work for the swisher, laid it on the block. Cup full of scissor, drank it some bark. Work for the swisher, laid it on the block. Good DJ ASAP. We're here with All Bay Hip Hop. I got Clyde Carson here with me. What's up, Clyde? What's up, man? Clyde's gonna be a good night. As soon as I pull up, your bitch is goodbye. He took the Bay by storm for, the, uh, for many years. Maybe like, uh, I'm gonna say from 2005, 2006. Really took it over the top, 2007. Signed the dotted line with Capital under the game with the Black Wall Street. Now, with that being said, you know, we didn't hear from him for a while. So, why don't you pick up there? I came out with a couple singles. Uh, two step and doing that, those kind of generated buzz for me. I was able to go on a world tour with Game when he was promoting the LAX album, uh -huh. which uh, exposed me all over the world. I was able to uh, go from Africa to all through Europe, Russia, uh, all through the States. For the last, I guess, year and a half or two years, I've been recording, just trying to make sure the music I put out is on the level that I want it to be. Now, I mean, I'm, I'm in the music game and I understand that, you know, when you're on the independent level, like I know you're part of Mojo, uh, before you do sign that dotted line, you're able to do yourself independently. Right. Now, right. when you being signed, I know you had a lot of the big, probably negotiation part because you had your own fan base. Is that why you kind of didn't do too much after doing that in two step? Would they stop you? Would they not let you do you? There was uh, situations at the label to where it's, I can't really blame anybody. I don't like to point the finger. Yeah. But it was just it was just situations to where uh, I didn't feel like I was able to produce the music that I wanted to produce. Uh, I wasn't uh, getting the production that I wanted. I, I think Two Step was good. I thought doing that was good. Two completely different types of songs. Mm -hmm. But at the same time. Uh, I, I just didn't feel like uh, the music was ready after that. We didn't feel like theater music was ready or what we wanted to give to the people. Yeah. Uh, we didn't all agree on it, but I felt like we could, you know, we wanted to do better. And so we pulled back and you know, we kept recording. And really, it's just been a lot of recording going on. Well, it's good to hear. Well, so hopefully we'll see something soon. Yeah, no. See something coming out soon? Yeah, uh, I got a new album, a new street album coming out called uh, Something to Speak About. Okay, something so, to Speak About. Something now, to Speak About. Is it directed towards, uh, you know, but yeah, it catches it. Just this is overall. The it? only thing that I really directed to the Bay Area was Space Rock. We didn't really, uh, okay. we put that out and we we put that out straight for the Bay. I was like, okay, we're going to drop something just for the, the real die hard. You know? Okay. It wasn't really ready to put it out to the world yet. So okay. it, wasn't, it wasn't, it didn't get promoted as this project was. Okay. This project we plan to promote. Uh, of course, in the world. Saying, um, yeah. you know, hyping yourself, shamelessly yeah. promoting my, my, my drink. You know? You know? <laughs> hey, I'm promoting it. Yeah, it's all it is good. probably one of the best things to drink. If you got anything else coming out with that as well, or are you pushing well, me? Yeah, um, we got hyping juice that's in all stores uh, throughout the Bay Area and uh, uh, pretty much on uh, the West Coast. And we, we got some new drinks that uh, actually are dropping, actually, really will be in stores uh, this month. Some new drinks that we got that we're working on out in LA. You guys will be seeing them. So it's, uh, and it'll be all over the country. So I, I sometimes come across people and say, man, you guys still got hype juice? And I'm like, man, it's, it's in the stores, man. You should just go buy it. So we're going to make sure it's in all stores, you know what I mean? So where can we find this stuff and stay updated with you? You know, the Twitter, the MySpace, MySpace slash Clyde Carson, at Clyde Carson on Twitter. I don't know my Facebook. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm a late boomer. Man, yeah, there's the blogs and, uh, you know, I I'll be popping up, man. I'll, I'll be putting out music for all the people and all the fans that really been wanting some music. Yeah, man. Well, thanks for all of you down, you know, all the hip-hop. All the hip-hop. Urban Cuts, you know? Yeah, Urban Cuts, man. I might get a fade or something. I really just got cut. If I didn't get cut, I'd let somebody cut me. I mean, we just have to do it. Because I know my guy does the thing. Yeah. Thanks for all of you down with us. Full of scissor, drinking some black, perp in the swisher, leaning on the low. Rewind, you can find Clyde leaning on your hoe. Gas in the ears, clear your peace, wanna go. Beast for the dough, same for the cake. 